It's Moha and Tiffany, and it's story time! Story time! I go visiting. For the letter V, visiting. Now we're not visiting anybody in the quarantine, but hopefully soon we'll be able to go visiting. Today I am a sleepover guest, so my behavior will be the best. I'm excited and happy too. My friend will be waiting for me. See, he goes to his friend's house. The friend is waiting. He's so excited. Come on in. So many books and games to share. We take turns because it is fair. So many books and toys to share. Look at them sharing so nicely. We play together with all the toys. If someone is sleeping, we don't make noise. Shh, is there any the baby sleeping? It'd be very quiet. Being a guest is so much fun. I remember to clean up when I'm done. That's right, we always have to clean up after. A good guest helps when he is able, so he brings napkins to the table. Okay, they're setting the table, and even though he's a guest, it's not his house, he's helping by bringing the napkins to the table. I make a bracha. The food tastes great. I finish everything on my plate. Bring a bracha. Finishing everything on my plate. You don't have to. Thank you so. Everything. You don't have to finish everything. I do tell that to Tavi. You don't have to. If you're full, if you feel like your belly is full, then you don't have to finish everything. When you're done, you say thank you very much. I say, being polite is the nicest way. See, when she stands up, she brings her plate to the sink and throws out any garbage on the table. The mommy told us it's time for bed. I listen quickly to what she said. You know what, if you listen nicely and you're really good, then when you wanna go again, the mommy is like, oh yeah, she's such a good guest. Let's have her again. Here or at my house every night, I brush my teeth to keep them white. Make sure to brush those teeth. in the morning and at night. I put my pajamas without a peep, say Shema, and go to sleep. She puts on her pajamas, and says Shema, and goes to sleep. I say Moda'ani, when I wake and wash my hands with a bowl and a cup. Morning we wake up, we say, thank you Hashem for giving me my neshama, right? We wash our hands every morning. Fluff the pillow and tuck in the sheet. I make the bed look nice and neat. He's fluffing his pillow his blanket her blanket nicely out so tonight when she's ready to go to bed the bed is so welcoming and ready for her or him see how quickly i'm ready and dressed it was really great to be your guests i pack up my things and remember to say, what do you think he's remembering to say? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for having me. So he packs up his things. And then he rem remembers to say, goodbye and thank you for having me stay. The end. The end. 
all about how being a good guest and visiting your friend. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Thanks.